So you want to start with something that uh, has pretty much limbs independent, doesn't have too much cloudy stuff, pretty much a humanoid in T-Pose. Uh, something like this won't work because of the base. Same with this. This might work. I'm going to try this one. And just download it. And then in Blender, go to File, Import, GLB. And then find thing you just downloaded. It'll take a second. And in Blender, what you have to do is you have to rotate it. Um, if you go to the, the Z rotation, make it negative one. You can type it in. Oh, or just rotate it however you rotate it so that it's facing forwards. This uh, negative Y. Uh, the rest should be fine. You export that as an FBX anywhere. Default settings. And go to Mixamo. Mixamo, you'll have to make an account. It's free. You upload the character. Make sure you upload the FBX and not the GLB you downloaded because by default that GLB doesn't work with Mixamo. Which is why we rotated it. Hopefully there won't be errors. Mixmo is a bit of a uh, a guesswork kind of thing, but if it looks more or less like this, it should work. Something to note is is there's either gonna be thumbs and sort of a palm thing you see on here. It's all sort of merged together, the fingers, or there may be no fingers at all. So you're gonna pick either. Two chain fingers if there's a thumb, or no fingers if there's no fingers at all. But for this, there's a bit of a thumb, so it should work. We're just placing those just as uh, Mixamo walks us through it. And this will take a little time. Too far from human, it won't work that well. There we go. So you can see it's the, the rig works. Just click Next. You might get an error here you and have to restart, but... It seems to be working. So now you just download. You can download um, any animation or no animation. It, it should be on t by default. But uh, download that. You'll get a new FBX. And you want to put that FBX in your Unity folder. Uh, so I've got that over here. I'm going to drag that into Unity. I've got the VRChat SDK using the creative, uh, creator companion from VRChat. And drag that into the scene. You just ignore whatever animation it is, but select it, the FPX, and under rig, go to humanoid. You have to do this. You shouldn't get any errors. It should be fine because it's for Mixamo. And since I drag this into the scene, I can click on it and go to Add Component. And I've already typed it in, the Avatar Descriptor. And now you just have to set the view position for where the face is, more or less. And... There's not going to be any lip sync or eye look or anything like that. Right now, you'd have to add that stuff. But this is good for now. I'm going to hit uh, or go to the air chat SDK. I have to go up here and show a control panel. But you'll see there's some errors. Auto fix. And oh, the one other thing is it's missing the texture. So the other step you have to do to convert it is to go back into Blender where you've imported it. And if you go into Texture Pane or UV Editing, you'll see the texture is here. It just didn't export to the FBX. So I'm going to go to Image, Save As. I'm going to go to my um, Unity folder, and we're going to save that image into the Unity folder. Go back to Unity, it's there. And drag it on. There you go. By the way, this is 50,000 triangles by default, so 
it'll be good for PC avatars, but you're going to have to decimate it in Blender if you want to be Quest compatible. But that should be good. Build and publish. And there you have it, it's VRChat Avatar.